don't buy that knife I know you're looking at that cave And you're feeling kind of brave Go to bed, you'll be alright Don't buy that knife There's nothing that is gonna change If you just wait until the day Zombies wanna eat your brain. Don't buy that knife I know it's me you're gonna fake Make a bed, it's not too late Three wall and three wooden planks Don't buy that knife How many times I have to say Hey guys, what's up? It's Dragon Ball Rock A6 back again, and in this video, I'm going to be reviewing. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I'm going to be reviewing this. This is the f Fantasy Texture Pack that just came out a few days ago. I, I wanted to get this out the day of uh, the day that it actually came out, but. I was having some serious issues with the Uphog uh, capture application and that sheep just took, I mean that freaking pig just took my minecart, but anyway, <laughs> yeah, I was having some serious problems with it and it's still not working correctly for me, so I'm still using ArcSoft Showbiz and that's good and bad because some of my videos end up lagging really bad. Um, Minecraft seems to be fine. It seems to work just fine with this, but when I do my WWE 2K14 videos, it seems like it freezes up. I mean, it lags quite a bit. So, yeah. Let's get started with this video. There's what the pumpkins are going to look like. And, I mean, they don't look too terribly different. They have a different facial expression now. They're smiling, which I'm not a big fan of, to be honest. Here's your textures of steps. Every single step you can get in the game. And this is your redstone repeater. And here's what your can't your uh yeah your torches are gonna look like. Which honestly I like these the best that I've seen so far of all the texture packs because you can actually see the little bit of wax melting in that. It's like it adds a little touch to it. And here is all the blocks in this texture. Your glowstone, of course, which I kind of like it actually. Here's your ores. That I believe is nether, if I'm not mistaken. Here's what your water looks like, and it's more like a clear. And I like it. I actually kind of like this. There's your redstone ore behind it. And there's your diamond and your lupus and your gold and your can't remember what those are. I think one of them's iron and one of them's stone. I can't be 100% sure. But there's what your TNT looks like, which looks a little weird. There's your bookshelf. There's your freaking G's. I can't believe I have to refer to this. Um, I believe. No, it's not a piston. Yeah, it's a dispenser. That's right. The dispenser and here's your two pistons sticky and regular this is a note block which I don't think I can do it without breaking it so this is your sponge and here's all your different wools which the colors look a lot a lot uh, more smoother and they look more realistic because it looks like they've been tied and everything here's what your ice looks like which is real clear and kind of nice if you were building a home and you want a, like a really nice clear window this probably would work there's your woods which got a pretty decent makeover too here's what the landscape itself looks like when you spawn I kinda like the mixture the uh, cobblestone at least I think that's cobble freaking geez I can't remember let me check this thing out here yeah, that's what I thought. That's your stone. And then your grass is that color, of course. Here's your doors. It's your wooden door, and this is your iron door. Pretty sweet. And there's your glass. And your melon. And your cactus. This is your jukebox, which looks pretty sweet. And this is your chest. Yeah, that's what I thought. No, wait. This is your crafting bench, what am I thinking? And here's your nice uh, enchantment table. 
Which, I kind of like the design of the book in this one. It looks like more 3D. I mean, it's not really as pixelated as what most of the other ones are. And this is your furnace. Which, I've pointed out to several of my friends that's already gotten this pack. That it looks like a doghouse. Because you got the hole there and then you got the shield crest up here. So you could probably use this pretty good for whenever you tame a dog. Here's your brewing stand, obviously. Looks pretty sweet. Here's some of the plant life. There's your, f your roses, your red roses, and there's your yellow flowers. Um, is that lava in the middle of that swamp? No, pumpkins. Okay. But yeah. Here's the, uh, just one example of the paintings you can get in this in this uh, texture. Pretty sweet looking. It looks like a villager with a <laughs> in king form. I kind of like it. Um, yeah, there's your sign and your fences look like. I'm gonna go over here, which this track was supposed to lead me to. It's my portals. Yeah, I made a pretty damn long track. <laughs> I think I'll show you nether first. There's what your goss looks like. Here's the nether brick of course and I'm not gonna really investigate this too much because I don't want to lose the portal, but there's what your zombie pigmen look like. They look like ninja ninjas or something, I don't know. I don't know what the hell those are supposed to be. Um, leave a comment in the comment section below if you know what those are supposed to actually be. <coughs> My guess actually, now that I'm looking at them, is people that were sentenced to death and they were given the blindfold and killed. So I don't know. But yeah. I'm gonna go back to the real world here. Okay. Let's check out the under. Okay. In this world, for some reason, I spawned in a uh, in, s in underground, which is rare in the Ender. Usually, you spawn on a cliff or something. But okay, here's what the Endermen look like. They got that shield on their forehead, which I don't like. And then they got these like iron arm. I mean, iron uh, gauntlet gloves and boots. I think they could have done better on the Endermen. They really, I mean, I'm not a fan the way they look. Oh, let's see if I can get you a good look at the dragon. The dragon actually has ha has armor on it with this fantasy update. Provided I can get to him and show you guys. You know what? He usually comes down here to try to hit you. So I'm going to just chillax right here until he comes down. Come on. Come on. Come on, you freaking ender dragon. Okay, I can't wait here forever. It's taking up too much time in the video to try to wait for him. Oh, well, Shins can get a good look at him if he'd hold still for two seconds. Let's show you his armor. Uh 
How is he gonna get go down there? Yes. There's his armor. He's got armor on his neck and his head. And all over. That's his big update. Now we're gonna leave the other ender, I mean. Okay. Alrighty. Well, this was fun trying to find before. Oh, here's a good showcase. I can show you the creeper. Oh, there's where I gotta go over there. Here's what the creeper looks like. They could have did better on him, but... Oh, well, I guess. Here's what your skeletons look like. They look pretty cool. If I can find a zombie in here. Well, I'm trying to find him. Alright. Screw it, it's taking too much time. Here's what your slime will look like. It's like this bluish color. It's what your spider looks like. Which kind of looks creepy with those blue eyes at night. So it's, it's well lit here though, so you won't see it. And here's what your zombie looks like. He looks pretty sweet too. Um, here's what your wolf looks like. Not very many differences here, folks. As, well, as far as the animals spawn, and the animals go. See, like, not very much. Here's what the magma cubes are supposed to look like. There's what your mushroom looks like. Again, not very many differences as far as the animals go. What your blaze looks like. So what your cave spider looks like. Just a smaller version of the big one. You already seen the Enderman. You already seen the Ghost and the Zombie Pigmen. Here's what your Ocelot looks like. And lastly, here's what your villagers look like. They don't look too bad, actually. But yeah, guys, that's it. That's pretty much it. That is pretty much it, because I don't see anything else that I need to review. Oh yeah, wait, there is... 
just gonna show you what these look like. I'm not gonna go through every little detail. And there's what the diamond armor looks like and the diamond sword. Here's what your bow looks like. This is what your, your fishing rod looks like. And there's your shears. And there's your map. And here's your flint and steel. But yeah guys, Dragon Little Rock 86, and this is my review of the Fantasy Texture Pack. I will catch you all later. So, laters! Bye now.